Welcome to our Excel tutorial. In this guide, you'll learn a valuable skill. Adding a grand total line to a pivot chart. This can make your pivot charts even more informative and insightful. So, let's get started. Assuming that you have a list of data in range B1. C5 that contains sales data and you will create a pivot table based on those data. And then create a column chart based on the created pivot table. Now if you want to add average line in the pivot column chart, you can do the following steps. First, ensure you've created a pivot chart using your data. If you're new to this, select the source data B1, C5, and go to Insert tab. Click Pivot Table command under Tables group to create a pivot table. And the Create Pivot Table dialog will open. Select Existing Worksheet Radio button, and select one cell as the location. Click OK button. Checked fields in Choose Fields to add to Report section in Pivot Table Fields pane. And the pivot table is created. Select the above pivot table, and go to Insert tab, click Insert Column Chart command under Charts group and one column chart based on the pivot table is created. Select the sales column in the original data, and right-click on it. Select Insert from the pop-up menu list to insert a new column, and type Average in the first cell. Type the formula in the Average column. Equals Average left bracket dollar D two dollars colon dollar D five dollars right bracket and then press enter key, and then drag the autofill handle down to other cells. Select the pivot column chart, and go to analyze tab, click refresh command under data group. The average field will be displayed in the pivot chart fields pane, and then checked average checkbox. Select Average Data Series in the Pivot Chart, and select Change Series Chart Type, and the Change Chart Type dialog will open. Click Combo Menu in the left pane, and choose the Sum of Average box in the Choose the Chart Type and Axis for your Data Series section, and select Line as Chart Type. Click OK button. The average line has been added into the Pivot Chart. And there you have it adding a grand total line to a pivot chart in Excel. This simple yet effective technique can help you gain deeper insights from your data. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe for more Excel tutorials and tips.